Brendan, what the hell are you doing? Oh, Joe's gonna have friends over. Yeah, and I told you no. You do know I pay rent for this apartment too, right? You haven't paid rent in like three months. And? And the landlord has been riding my ass this whole time while I've been covering yours. And I can barely afford to pay all this rent without all the other bills too. All right, listen, dude. The stress isn't good for your health. I read, I read that on Facebook once. Just come over here and play some games with us. No, pal, you listen here. You haven't even thought about getting a job in the last six months. Instead, you've just been sitting here on a couch that I bought, by the way. I think you've lost all the right to making decisions in this house. Yeah, what about all the food I buy for this place, huh? You mean all the munchies? I haven't had a single real meal since August. That was like yesterday. That was four months ago. Well, I think that means it's almost Christmas. Nice. And there goes your last Didn't you say you were getting a check from your parents? Yeah, yeah, that came in actually. Uh, it came in a while ago. I, I bought some food with it. Actually, where'd that food go? Okay. Oh, hello. How can you live like this? Can you, can you like tell them to leave these sucks? It's ruining the game. No need to. I'm gonna leave on my own. God forbid you make me happy. And... I'm gonna call the landlord and get my name off this lease, because I'm done paying for your fucking sorry ass. Hey, who are you calling? Mary Poppins. Who the hell do you think I'm calling? God, I'm calling the landlord, you dumbass. Are you serious about that? Of course I was fucking serious about it. You've been mooching off me for months. I can't stand it anymore. Dude, let's just try to be rational about this. I am being rational about it! It's you that needs to start learning how to be rational! You're, you're a goddamn adult, so start acting like it! Well, if I'm an adult, then you have no right to boss me around, Well, okay? maybe you should grow up and get a life! Well, maybe you should fix your damn social life and we wouldn't have an issue! At least I have friends and family that like me. Hey! Hey, man. Uh, you come back in, the next round's about to start. Bitch, fucking instant. Get beat shit. Don't put the controller down. You're kind of still so bummed about your roommate, are you, dude? What I, you I did hit him pretty hard below the belt. He's a prick, he deserved it. But Caden didn't deserve that. I should find him and I should apologize to him. I don't know what crawled up your ass and died. But can you chill out? You're ruining the vibe here. Oh, you're fucking out. You're fucking out. <laughs> Get out. What? God, you heard me. Get out. Dude! What the shit? You can't do this to us. We're your friends. I can, actually, because this is my apartment. Now get your asses out. Whatever, man. You know what? Your roommate was right about you. You're a good for nothing bum. You got no fucking future. Yeah, well, I'm gonna start taking responsibility like I should have done long ago. Now get out. I can't believe you've done you. this. Get a dick. Get out. Screw you. Go, get a fucking life. Jesus. Can you believe the nerve of that guy? I mean, I know he stoops low, but I never thought he'd stoop that low. I mean, where does he even get the balls to say something like that? Well, at least I can take comfort in that I'm a responsible adult. And yet here you are, still running from your problems like you always do. What? If you were really a responsible adult, you wouldn't be here talking to me right now. You'd be out there dealing with it head on. The way I see it, you are just as childish as Brandon. I'm not running. I'm just giving him time to sort this all out before I actually have to call the landlord. Oh, please. You're never going to call the landlord. After your childhood of crappy, p abusive parents and terrible foster homes, Brandon's all you got left, and you both still have some growing up to do. Now go. But... No buts, just get out there and apologize to his sorry ass and make up for this and talk it out like civilized men. Or just fall back into the same loop, I guess. It's your choice. That's what I thought. Hey, thanks again, all right? Jesus, man. I was looking all over for you. I went to our apartment and walked in and it was all clean. I thought I walked in the wrong one. Yeah. <laughs> Who was that on the phone? My dad. Really? 
what she called him for. Long story short, I have, an, I have a job interview on Wednesday. Really? It's a retail job. It, it'll just pay the bills. Oh, yeah. Here. What's this? A share of this month's rent. Where'd you get this from? It's the money my parents gave me for Christmas. I thought you spent that on munchies. You didn't have to do that again. Yeah, I really did. You're right. I was a piece yeah, I was a piece of shit to you. And I'm gonna pay you back. Alright? And it's about time I grow up. You were right about that. And I owe it to you. God, I don't I don't even know what to say. I don't say anything. Again, piece of shit who you had to deal with for months. I, this is as much as I could do to repay you. And you know, I owe you. I mean, I've been a shitty friend too, this whole time. I've just been a tight ass. I've been a prick. And I've learned through this um, few past hours that you, know, you got, just gotta sit back and enjoy life. Working, you know? Merry Christmas, Kaden. It's only the 15th. Go with it. What the hell? Merry Christmas, Brandon. <laughs>